Congratulations on uh, being an NFL draft pick. It's real realization of a lifelong dream. What was your reaction? Oh, just uh, pure joy, pure joy. Just so you know, excited to uh, come be part of that organization, and I'm going to give everything I got to not only Cincinnati but uh, that Bengals organization. How much does your athleticism kind of give you give you or gave you an advantage in your college career? I, you know, I think uh, when you watch my film, a lot of guys have, and scouts and GMs, whatever coaches, you turn it on, you you see that jump out. Uh, but really, I you know. I think that's just going to hopefully cross over the NFL and, and continue to develop as I go, and, and, and every, everything will continue to develop. So I'm looking forward to it all. Tan, what's today been like for you? Did you think you might go earlier? Has it been frustrating, or is this a relief? You know, God's got a plan for all of us, and I'm right where I need to be. I cannot wait to get there. What were your conversations like with the Bengals before the draft, visits, all that kind of stuff? Yeah, just routine, uh, just routine conversations, uh, and uh, like I said, I'm I'm overjoyed right now, so I, I'm at a loss for words. I'm just excited to get going. How uh, how impressed were you with James Casey, the tight end coach? Oh, I I really like Coach Casey. Uh, we had some good conversations, and uh, um, he, he liked my game, so I'm glad he liked it enough to believe in me as long as well with the uh, rest of the staff. So. Uh, once again, just overwhelmed and super excited to get out there. You grew up in Canada, correct? Yes, sir. Did you play American football growing up? Did you play Canadian football? What was your background as a kid? Yeah, it was Canadian football through high school, and then I did one year of American football down in Arizona. What was that transition like for you? What was kind of the, the biggest thing you had to grasp as you uh, kind of made that switch? Uh, biggest thing was, you know, in Canada, you can run up to the line of scrimmage. So I was an ex receiver back when I played in high school. So, you know, I was running up to the line of scrimmage and I came down to the United States when played in Arizona and uh, they, they transitioned to me like a stand up wide tight end slot basically. So, uh, just different and, and really just understanding the game and the different nuances. But, uh, I, I feel like it went pretty smooth for the most part. It's all, it's football at the end of the day. So it's all the same thing. In college, what was the balance of where they lined you up, in line, slot, all that kind of stuff? Uh, they really did everything, and that was the beauty of playing at Arizona. I played in a pro-style offense, so you know I was able to line up outside, line up in the slot, line up, line up in line. So whatever was asked of me, I felt like I could go out and execute, and I'm hoping that Cincinnati feels the same way here this upcoming year. Chase Brown, one of the Bengals' running backs, is uh... – Canadian, do you know about Chase? By any chance, would you have ever crossed paths before? I, know I did not know about Chase, and I'm going to have to reach out to him because there's not many of us down there. So that's really good to hear. So Joe Burrow, Jamar Chase, T. Higgins, obviously a lot of uh, well-known star, skill position players on this Bengals roster. How do you feel about joining that group? Oh, I can't wait. I can't wait to be around guys like that and, and you know, come in and do my 111th. And whatever, whatever is after me, I, I'm excited to go do it and do it to the best of my ability. So overwhelmed again. I was so excited to go play with those guys, and, and I'm, I'm just looking forward to it all. Do you feel, uh, Tanner, that your age uh, is a benefit to you? Yeah, and, and through the, the, the process, you could, you know, some said it was a benefit, some said it was a negative, but... Uh, I, I believe it to be a benefit. I've always been kind of a late bloomer, and you know I'm gonna I'm gonna ride with it. I my age is what it is, but I'm excited to uh, you know go out there and and continue to develop. So I think my best ball is ahead of me. Do you know that Joe Burrow's dad played in the CFL? I did not know that. Little uh, icebreaker for you when you meet him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, for real. Yes, sir. Yep. Have you? Uh, uh, paid attention to uh, the draft closely over the last couple of days, and you know that uh, you're the, already the second uh, tight end selected by the Bengals? Yeah, 100%. And, and uh, Eric and I got to know each other at the Combine, so uh, looking forward to uh, getting to work with him and the rest of that tight end room. And, uh, you know, it's just going to be development for both of us, so I'm looking forward to it all. Tanner, do you model your game after any any current NFL players? Uh, there's a few, but uh, none in particular at the moment. I'm just, uh, you know, again, excited to get going. What about putting your hand in the dirt at the end of the line of scrimmage and, and uh, 
you know, blocking defensive ends outside linebackers at the NFL level. Is that something that you uh, look forward to as a competitor? Oh, 100%. I, I, you know, I kind of touched on it earlier. Any situation that they, they trust me to go in and execute, I'm going to go do it to the best of my ability. And, uh, again, I mentioned it as well. I got lots to develop and lots, lots of room to grow. Uh, and I'm just going to, you know, have that chip on my shoulder and, and continue to work through this next year and, and hopefully the next few years. I think we're good. Uh, I got I got it. I got it. Yeah, I was going to say, I got to go hang out with my family. I'm, I'm <laughs> anxious to celebrate with them. Uh, thank you so much. So. I appreciate all the questions. All right. We'll Thanks, see you in a week or two.